Welcome everyone, Farmer Cup here. This is going to be the top 10 mods of the week. Um, I do apologize, my mouth is still recovering from having my wisdom teeth removed. So um, if I sound a little bit different today, hopefully that it's not that different. So yeah, these are for all platforms. All 10 of my mods today are for all platforms. So we're going to go ahead and just jump right into it. All right, for number one this week, we have the Fella Grassland Equipment Pack, which technically came out last Saturday, but I don't include Saturday's mods in my top 10, so I just include them on the next week if they end up coming out good. So this is by Vertex Design featuring Mad Max and Rafnix. This is 43.50 megabytes to download for all platforms. Currently rated a whopping 4.8 out of five stars with 229 people having rated it. This pack contains several pieces of equipment. I have two shown out here, a small mower and a big wind drawer hooked up to the back of this tra tractor here. We go into the store here under the fellow grassland equipment pack. This is the stuff that it comes with. So it comes with a 14 meter uh, working with wind drawer. It has a 6.3 meter, a 3.6 meter and three meter mower. The tools can be worked and combined for like basically a 6.6 meter then we have a tether at 8.6 meters so you guys seem to really like this pack so there you go um yeah very cool stuff a good looking pack really well done um, vertex design always does a really good job so there you guys go for number two, we have the Case IH Vestrum series. This is by Redcat 3D, Lucas 2002. 13.92 megabytes to download for all platforms. Currently rated a 4.9 out of five stars with 103 people having rated it. Um, it has this really cool, you can kind of see metallic color to it. Um, so very cool inside the store if we take a look at it here. Um, if we go into here, 102,800 starting price, lots of wheel configuration options, beacon lights, EU and US configurations, weight carrier or three point on the front um, or extra weights, uh, mirror inside, yes or no, uh, front loader attached has several options available for you and then um, it can go from 100 horsepower all the way up to 130 main color can be again change that metallic red um, 145 years edition or you have gray um, black and you can also go with the municipal orange there so and again you also have a license plate uh, but there you go very cool tractor that is the case ih vestrum series for number three, we have the Old Stream Farm. This is by Black Sheep Modding. This is 219.94 megabytes um, to download. This is for all platforms. It currently, it came out just yesterday from when you guys are watching this. Um, so it recently came out here. 4.6 out of five stars is what it was rated when I saw it and did my map tour on it. And it currently has a 370 people having rated it. So it's doing very well. I know this is a very popular map back in FS19, uh, uh, but as far as the description goes, it says, welcome to, and by the way, you're seeing on your screen right now, just part of my map tour to it. Feel free to check out the whole, the whole thing on my channel. Uh, but it says, welcome to the Old Stream Farm. The famous farm of the 70s is back with for even more fun, located in a fictional European style countryside. The roads will take you to the small town of Dorfbach and Grunwald. So a very cool map, very well done, very highly detailed. I definitely recommend you guys checking that out. Um, and one last final note too, as far as mods go in general, make sure you guys are rating them five out of five stars. It does help modders out um, and it does them a big favor because they don't make very much off of their mods. They lose 50% of their income if they drop below four stars. So if you like the mod, make sure you guys are rating it five out of five stars. But um, that's my spiel on that. Let's go ahead and jump into the next one. For number four today, we have the Wholesale Mod by Zottlezok. This is 1.99 megabytes to download for all platforms. Currently rated 4.8 out of five stars with 70 people having rated it. This is essentially a sell point. So if we go into our build mode here, um, just get us angled over here towards this. Um, under build mode, if we go to production and selling points at the very end, you have the wholesale, which will take all these various items here, which I don't even know what that one is at the very end, uh, but there you go. It's gonna take a lot of different items for you. So apparently people really like this one. So there you go, it got well rated. That is the wholesale uh, sell point by Zottlezok. For number five, the decorative details pack. I was super excited to see this and excited to use a lot of this on No Man's Land. These are placeable uh, decorations by Triangles Trouble. 6.86 megabytes to download for all platforms. Currently rated 4.8 out of five stars with 105 people having rated it. I believe there's a total of 45 or so different things in here uh, of various prices. These are just a few of them out and about. If we go into the store, um, from what I can tell, or at least the build mode here, what I can tell most of them are found under decoration, under others, I haven't gone through all of them, but. You can see there is an absolute ton of different decorative items in here. If you wanted the park or um, boulders down or cement pallets or a, a saw there, it's all stuff from base game that you'll find in different locations, but now you have the option to place it kind of wherever you want, which is pretty cool. So a very nifty pack to have. I'm very glad that came out. That is the decorative details pack by uh, Triangles Trouble. For number six, we have the John Deere 4755-4955 by AAA Modding, 41.00 megabytes to download for all platforms, currently rated 4.8 out of five stars with 167 people having rated it. Um, this is a very popular tractor. I enjoyed using this in FS19. Um, I can't remember what version I used. I know there's a couple different versions that came out, but if we take a look at this in the store here, um, we have the 4755 US, 
US two-wheel drive, EU, and EU two-wheel drive, which I think I have the US two-wheel drive out just to show the two-wheel drive off. But um, yeah, lots of different configurations, front loader attachments, stuff like that is all available for you. You can see the range of horsepower is 192, 28 on all of these guys. So um, a really cool pack, a really cool kind of older school John Deere tractor to use on your farm. So if you're a John Deere fan, there you go, the John Deere 4755, 4955 series. All right, for number seven, this is more of a quality of life mod. This is the 120 tree sapling. So it's just hooked up to a tractor with a tree planter there and you see the pallet in the back there. But what we're talking about here is the pallet itself. This is by Mac Trucker 921, uh, 0.22 megabytes to download for all platforms. Currently rated 4.8 out of five stars with 60 people having rated it. What this does is when you go in the store to buy a pallet of saplings, you now have instead of, I think, I, th I can't remember what the base game one is. I think it's 20 saplings in a pallet. This one has 120 saplings, so six times the saplings, if it is 20, if I'm doing my math correct all there. But anyhow, it just increases the amount of saplings you can have um, as far as available to you. It's $3,500 to purchase the pallet, so it is a little bit more expensive, um, is my understanding. But anyhow, it's just it's just such a nice quality of mod, or quality of life mod that will help you so you don't have to continuously reload your tree planter if you're out planting trees. So there you go. That is the 120 tree saplings uh, packed by Mac Trucker 921. All right, for number eight, we have the John Deere a 600 FD and 700 FD pack by Agritono Modding. 31.01 megabytes to download for all platforms. Currently rated a whopping 4.9 out of five stars with 66 people having rated it. Um, it is not the harvester, it is the harvester bar on the front. The cutters on the back are on the front there. Basically, you see that kind of uh, big old pipe set up on the front there, that is the, um, the air bar, which gives you the option to add the air bar to it. I don't think it has any effect on yield or anything like that, but just kind of a looks thing if you wanted to play a little bit more realistically. Um, inside the store, if we go under this pack here, there's several different options and different uh, configurations, but any one that you're inside of here, if you wanted the, oh, of course my configurations now weren't working in there. Yep, there we go, now it's working. So you go to standard, you can go to air bar, and again, you can change the colors to kind of whatever you'd like on there. But if you want the air bar attachment on there, you can have that air bar. So uh, pretty cool mod, I'm glad to see that coming in just for a little bit more realis realism to the game. But that is the John Deere 600 FD and 700 FD pack by Agartono. And for number nine, uh, Omatana, of course, is continuing to knock it out of the ballpark with her placeables. This is the fermenting silo, which is 1.95 megabytes to download for all platforms with a whopping 4.9 out of five star rating, 105 people having rated it. This is gonna be found in the build mode here. If we go under build mode, um, and we go to, it's actually meant our production factories. Um, find it right under here, the fermenting silo, it will take in uh, chaff, grass and hay and convert it to silage for you. So it gives you the ability to make hay silage. Now, well, it's not technically hay silage, but um, it'll make you silage out of hay, which you didn't have that option before. And this is a production facility to kind of just uh, do that work for you. So you don't have to worry about fermenting. So it might make your life way easier. So uh, definitely very cool to see that come to the game. Well done, uh, Omatana, as always, um, continuing to see more of what you had out. And Omatana also released another mod this week, but this is the cooler one, I think, in my opinion. But very cool. Well done, Omatana. That is the fermenting silo for you guys. All right, number 10 this week in our final mod is the Galignani, I'm probably just butchered the pronunciation, 9250SL by Pepe978. Pepe978 always does extremely high quality mods. This one is 7.38 megabytes to download. For all platforms, currently rated a 4.8 out of five stars with 100 people having rated it. It is a little baler here that gives you the option between 125 centimeter and 150 centimeter bales. Pickup width is two meters. Its price is 39,000 uh, euros, pounds, or dollars to purchase, and it only requires 90 horsepower. So just kind of a cool baler. Um, I use this baler a little bit in FS19, so just something a little bit new, something a little bit different, looks different, um, a new kind of brand for us there. So there you go. That is the Galagani uh, 9250 SL. And that is all of our mods for the week. Um, if you guys enjoyed this video, please drop a like down below. If you haven't already, hit that subscribe button up on the screen to join the Farmer Cop channel and turn your notification bell so you don't miss any future videos I may post. This has been Farmer Cop. Thank you guys for coming and for watching.